Hi, this is Phil with Japanese-Candlesticks.com. Today I'm going to show you a tool that I like quite a lot for scanning the entire market. And we're going to look at Japanese candlesticks as well as some other indicators that are used in the system. The system uses money stream, which tries to identify uh, when there's money that's flowing into a stock and time segmented volume does the same thing but it has a different formula and there's also balance of power which tries to find what are called um, stocks where the informed investors are buying the stock with balance of power when it's green here that means the informed investors are buying the stock when it's red, it means the uh, informed investors are selling. Now, they won't tell us what these formulas are. These are proprietary formulas. But there's many other formula, many other indicators we can use where we do know what the uh, formulas are behind it. But we have the option of using these proprietary indicators, and I like to use them because... Um, They've been lots of research over the years has gone into developing money stream, time segmented volume, and balance of power. Now I'm going to show you how we can very quickly scan the entire market of U.S. stocks for uh, those stocks where money is flowing into the stock, according to this indicator anyway. So it's very easy to do. This is my watch list of all U.S. stocks. Notice it's so, sorted right now alphabetically. And there's 5,983 stocks in the system. And you'll see how quickly we can sort all of the stocks. What I'm going to do is click on Money Stream and choose Quick Sort. After that, we go down and say that we want to base it on money stream moving up then we change move type here to smart and we have a slider then where we can say how fast we want money stream to be moving up I'm going to set it all the way to the right so we find all the stocks where money stream is moving up very quickly and notice on the left here these are all the stocks Let's see how quickly it sorts them. I'll click on the sort button now. And there we got all the stocks sorted by uh, money stream and got about 200 or so that are got strong money stream. And let's take a look at some of them. Here's the money stream down here. We want to see also, ideally, a confirmation from time segmented volume being above the dashed line and we want green bop and money stream moving up so this one looks pretty good from this point of view notice also that it's breaking out right here above this resistance area with a nice green hollow candle showing positive movement let's take a look at the next one Looks pretty good. It's the here's the this red line by the way is a 200 day moving average that tends to be resistance when a stock hits this 200 day moving average. And here's the 50 day moving average, the blue line. This one looks pretty good. It's not so much confirmed by BOP, balance of power. This is called BOP or balance of power, which again is supposedly measuring the buying of informed investors. They're using volume in connection with price to do that, but we don't know exactly what the formula is. Supposedly BOP will show hidden buying that you wouldn't normally see otherwise because price can be coming down while BOP is going up. Okay, let's take a look at a few more. Here's a stock <clears throat> TDSC that had a nice gap up from a doji 
which is a very strong buy signal. But now we had profit taking. Profit taking was over and stopped at the trend line. Started to move up. Then the stock fell through the trend line. And now it looks like it's coming back. It's curling back up. And what is Money Stream doing? Also crossing over its moving average. Time segment and volume is also crossing up. And balance of power is also. So here we have a confirmation. It looks like TDSC might be a good buy. Here's the stock I bought today. And uh, it just came up on my scan, <clears throat> but I bought it for other reasons than the scan. You can see it's got the change in BOP to green. It's got the crossover in time segment and volume and a huge surge here in money stream. And it's got a gap up, which is sometimes very good, especially when you have a nice green candle here after the gap up. Um, Steve Bigelow, uh, when he sees a pattern like this, he often says that the stock will be moving up at a 45 degree angle from here, typically. So there you have it. Let's review again how you might do this yourself. <clears throat> By the way, you can get this program for free for two weeks and try it out. What I'm going to do is I'm going to remove this column. So it takes away all of the those stocks and then I'm going to sort by so it's alphabetical okay so what would we do what would be the first thing we do if we want to scan for money stream moving up fast first thing we would do would be to click on money stream and then what do we pick next quick sort after quick sort what do we do we come over here and click on the based on and click this selection and then choose what? Moving up. And next we would do what? We click on move type here and set it to what? Smart. Now here it's you're up to you what you want to do. You can, if you wanted to see only those stocks where money stream is moving up very fast, you put the slider to the right. And uh, you can choose the color that you want for the check mark. Let's make it a green one this time. And let's do the sort. You would next click on sort. And then here you have it all the stocks that have very strong money stream. I hope you've enjoyed this little tutorial. I would uh, suggest that you try out TC2000. I think it's a great way to scan stocks at the end of the day. You can also do it in real time during the day. If you're a day trader, it might be good for that. But for if you're a swing trader, probably it's adequate to do the scan at the end of the day. The scan is so quick and easy and there's many, many ways to scan the market. and you can write your own formulas if you like, or you can just use the click method to scan for various uh, things. Click method, I mean uh, by clicking an indicator, or you could click price history and scan for all stocks moving up through their moving average, something like that. So anyway, um, happy trading. And uh, I think that this tool can make us a lot of money. Phil Sayer signing off. Until the next time, Japanese-Candlesticks.com.